What's up dolls again? I'm Janae. Welcome back to my channel. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. So um I'm getting ready for bed. I just took a shower. I washed my hair. Um I'm going to be showing you kind of like my night routine. Um, so yeah, like I said, shower and stuff is out the way. My hair is washed. Um, so now I'm going to be showing you guys what I use on my skin. Um, I have been seeing a dermatologist because my face, I don't know what was going on, but it was bad. I honestly feel like since I got my tubes tied, my acne has just been bad. So anyways, um, I don't know, it's looking like a lot better, you guys, because I was literally looking like a chocolate chip cookie. Um, it was to the point to where like, I wasn't even comfortable going outside really, because I was like, my skin looks so bad. So, my dermatologist gave me some medicine, and I feel like it's been working, but I feel like it's working slow. I guess for me, I like to see results overnight, and I know it's not like an overnight process, so my patience is like this. But, yes, it's working, so um, I'm about to get ready to go ahead. I need to go get it. But, um, yeah, so I noticed with the medicine that my doctor gave me, it was like burning my skin. My skin is really sensitive, so therefore I can't use like proactive. It's a lot of stuff I can't use. Um, so yeah, the medicine I noticed it was working, but it was drying me out like crazy and it was burning my skin. Um, to where it's like I, my skin was peeled and I looked like I had like a lizard skin or I was peeling like a snake or something. It was, it was bad. So anyways, I kind of got away from that for a while. And I've just been using the turmeric mousse cleanser, the daily facial cleanser. And then at the end, I just moisturize. Cause like I said, I, really like dry out really, really easy um but i noticed me just using like these three really 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 help the only thing that i can honestly say too like with the tool work you guys is you have to be careful because it does if you leave it on too long it kind of leaves like an orange tint on your skin if you don't care then okay but yeah so i'm about to wash my face so, I'm gonna start with the turmeric. And I just put the turmeric on my hands. And, and then while the turmeric is on, I know this looks crazy y'all, but hey, um, mm. while the turmeric is on, I get the cleanser, and then I moisturize with both of them at the same time. And then you guys, like my forehead is a lot better. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm telling you what I say. I was looking like a chocolate chip cookie. I was looking like a chocolate chip cookie. I had so many black spots on my forehead. It wasn't even funny. And you know, for me, I, for me, I feel like skin, you know, of course it's everything. Like when people see you, that's the first thing they see is your face. When you talk to people, that's the first thing they're looking at is your face. So yeah. I had to do something about it. So, leave it on for a little bit. Yeah. 
the um I kind of just let it dry and I do sometimes still go in and use like the witch hazel um that really works for me too but I know everybody's skin is different like I said for me um my skin is really sensitive so like stuff that has like the scent and stuff to it I cannot use I would be so broken out and so irritated like I have really sensitive skin so um like I said with the Cetaphil it's scent free pretty much and it's for like really 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 sensitive skin and it works for me so um yeah I let my face dry then after it dries, I go in and I do my moisturizing lotion. And I just use, just use a little bit. Now, since I do use the turmeric, um, sometimes it does like burn a little bit, but it don't last long. So, I just take it. But I really do have wanted to go get a chemical uh, pill, you guys. If you guys ever got a chemical pill, please comment down below. Let me know what your results were like. Because um, I want to do it, but my husband, he's like, well, babe, I don't think you should do it. What if it really damages your skin? Like, I know with everything that we do, we're taking, you know, some type of risk. It always has some type of side effect. But if you ever got a chemical pill, please comment down below. Let me know how your experience was. So let me show you guys to what my doctor um, prescribed for me. And let me get it real quick. Okay, so this is what it's called. And like I said, it, it helps, but it's a slow process and when she gave it to me she said that she was like it's going to help you're going to be happy with the results but it is going to be a very slow process and like i said i guess for me i wanted something that's going to work like that so um yeah this is what i've been using um and then i can say too like my forehead it looks amazing yeah you guys so like i said i'm going to be very open and very transparent with you guys um so yeah give me some feedback let me know because i i i'm i'm tempted i'm gonna go ahead i think and make an appointment and um i'm gonna do it and then i'm gonna take you guys on this journey with me but yes this is what i do as far as like my skincare routine for the nighttime and then when i wake up in the morning i wash of course with these two and then, like I said, just make sure I stay moisturized. That's the main goal. So um, I'm about to get ready. Just put my hair in my little scrunchie. Y'all know my I look crazy, but it's okay because I'm about to go to sleep. But um, yeah, I'm about to just put my hair in a ponytail. Oh, and then for me, you guys, I get um like really bad migraines so i cannot have um my hair like it can't be heavy and it can't be like really really tight because my head be hurting really really bad so yeah i'm about to get ready to go lay down and um i don't know i might watch a little bit of tv or something but i'm gonna show you okay you guys so i'm getting ready to go to bed and um as you can see my baby is in the bed with me um, little does she know she's about to get kicked out, but yes. Okay, doll. So my baby girl is still in the bed with me, but I am about to go to sleep. I don't feel like lifting her up right now. I'm about to turn off the lights, and maybe in the middle of the night, if she's sleeping too bad, I'll just kick her out or something. But I'm about to go to sleep. Peace out.